Hey, what's up, high levelers? In today's video, we're going to learn how to harness the power of RSS feeds with the social planner in Go High Level. Now, if you're not familiar with what RSS is, think of it like a webhook or a website URL that gives you access to all the latest blog posts of your website. For example, if you publish blog posts in Go High Level or your WordPress site, let's say about marketing automation, now with the RSS feed in the social planner, each time you make a blog post, it will generate a social post for you and then publish it automatically. And the best part is you only have to do this once, which means it will save you tons of time and effort. Now that we have a good understanding of this, let's jump into Go High Level and see how we can set it up. All right, so there are a couple of ways we can do this. If you publish blog posts for your website in Go High Level, then what you will do is head over to sites, under blogs, you will go to this gear icon and then select the RSS feed and it will look something like this. So you will have your RSS URL for the website that publishes blog posts and go high level. You'll copy this and then we'll follow the next steps. For now, I'm going to give you another example of, let's say if you publish blog posts on WordPress, then what you will do is you will type in the website URL for that website and then you will put a forward slash and say feed. And then you have to copy this. If I go to this link right here, you will see that it will say in a moment that this is a link to our RSS feed. So that means we have got it perfect. Now I'm going to head back to go high level and then we will head over to marketing and under the social planner, I'm just going to click on new post and then select the RSS post option. Now, as you can see, we have a few options here. So starting with RSS feed URL, this is where I will post my link and then you can choose your social account. So you can select Facebook, LinkedIn, Instagram, all that. I'm going to select Facebook and LinkedIn for now. And then it says end with. So end with is, is more like a space or a field for hashtags. So if you want to type in, let's say marketing or, you know, digital marketing, stuff like that, you can see on the right side as well. It is giving you a preview of how it will look like. And then you can also select uh, how often should we check for a new blog post. So if you do like every 15 minutes, then every 15 minutes, the crawler or the go high level bot will go to this RSS feed and search for some new blog posts. So if this website has posted any new blog posts or updates, it will fetch that and then make a post out of it and then publish it automatically. And then it also says how many max posts do we want per update. So there might there's a possibility if it's a big website, they're publishing multiple blog posts uh, at any given time. So you can select either one or multiple ones. I'm only going to select one for now and then create post here. Now this will take a few seconds while it crawls for some data and then you will be able to see some preview of what has happened here. And now if I go to the open planner button right here, you will see that it has populated all my calendar with blog posts each day. So there are already some blog posts that existed on this website. So I fetched all of them and generated posts all along my calendar. And if they have images and all that, then it will automatically fetch that too. For now, it was a dummy website, so it only got the text details and it got linked to the uh, blog post as well. All right, so that was how you can supercharge your content with the RSS feed and the social planner in Go High Level. I hope you liked this video. If you have any questions, feel free to put them in the comments section below and we will get back to you.